All right, we're going to be continuing with Dread X Collection Volume 2. I got my water, I got my coffee, I got my beer. I'm good to go. I just finished Solipsis, and we're going to be continuing with the next game. So that's one out of 12, I believe. And it's actually very interesting. The hub of the world itself is kind of like a mini game. So the VHS tapes are locked inside of these boxes and I have to choose my next one. But this door opened. Okay, so we got a light, that's cool. But um, this door opened, so let's, let's see what's beyond this door. Oh, wait a second. Is this gonna come to life? Maybe, um, maybe I have to put the weapons. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. No, that's, that's not right. Okay, I got a key. Welcome to my uh, menagerie of terror. I know, I know, not exactly ideal laboratory settings. I had to work with what was around, which given current circumstances, it, well, it was a lot of, <sighs> I, you'll see. Uh, but hey, don't knock it. This stuff is gonna save your life. In these rooms are 11 different contraptions. Each contraption holds another key. Solve a puzzle, get the key, watch another tape, rinse and repeat until cured. You can tackle the puzzles in any order. Uh, like I said, uh, I, I just can't actually give you an order. Ruining the surprise virus spreading in your brain, yada, yada, yada. Okay, well, you know what? I'm gonna wait until I do this because I just got a key, so I want to jump into the next game. But I just realized that this this painting here is... Uh, this is... Uh, isn't this like Bathsheba cutting off the head of Goliath or something, or David? It's 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 something or other. It's some, some king gets his head cut off. I remember this piece. And this one here is... This is actually very famous. This is Francisco Goya. Jupiter devouring his son or Saturn devouring his son. I I can't exactly remember, but I, I really I absolutely love this painting. This is a great painting I'm not sure. I'm not sure what this is, but I Don't want to go further um, Let's we, we, we just got a key so let's yeah, I think this is it too. This is this is part of it. This is this is another interpretation of it. Some woman cutting off a uh, head of a guy. I do want to explore what's on the outside. It seems like there's a shed here. I really like the orange skybox there. That's that's beautiful. Let's let's check out another game. Okay. Um let's check out so, okay, so I did Solipsis. Um, toy shop, sucker for love. I'm gonna save that. Let's let's do this one. This one looks cool. Oh yeah, I forgot. Okay, to the end of the days, the world is ending as a comet looms. Can you make it home to your family? Yes. Okay, we're to sell that All one. At once, it just turned on. There was no build or warning. One moment, it was a typical 
a frigid desert night. And then it wasn't. It was so bright that I nearly ran off the road. But not like the daytime kind. It was like a trillion neon signs packed too close together, all being lit up at once. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. Let's turn this on. How do I look? All right. I really like these indie games. I, I love the ideas that some of them explore. You know, the polish is, is actually surprisingly good. Hundred and sixty four hours. Okay. End of the world. Who saw it coming? Sure, we all like to joke around. Might as well send a comet and start over. But could you blame us? This collective societal apathy was programmed into us after constant exposure to rampant theft, violent crime, homicide, and the government corruption that enabled and monetized it. But the comet. The common isn't bringing a cleansing like those doomsday fanatic creeps like to think. The comet isn't the answer to anyone's prayers. The shit hits the fan and I'm a country away. Figures. Just my luck. I've got a ball and a chain to get back to. Good evening, everyone. We regret to inform Okay, what are the controls? Okay. Let's just do it. Face lifter? Oh, okay, I see. I like the simplicity of this, you know? That's how horror games should be. If this is... See if there's anything in these buildings. Okay, I'm not messing around now. Let's go. Let's go, boys.
Alright. You made me do this. Hey. You want some too? Hell yeah, look at this. If this is an American, I don't know what is. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so this is pretty much like... Everything has collapsed. You just gotta go for it, right? Rescue prisoners from cultists. All right, hang on. Is there help? That's just... I typically don't go for first person shooters, but uh um, Hey, it's all good. Oh god. That kinda got me a little bit. Ah oh, man, my health. These idiots got the jump on me. I'm playing around with these fools. Najda's kids. Najda. Did I just get too caught up into it? Do I... Oh god, dude, fuck! Oh, you piece of shit. Wait till I get my gun out, you fucking ass. Oh my god. Alright. <laughs> that got me. I was, I was reading something. Where's my uh, thing at? Oh, hey. I hate too many controls in my horror game. Was it... was it F? 
Oh damn, I shouldn't have put my gun away. The call is sent by the gods themselves. The calling will cleanse Kothra. Where's my gun at? Alright, give me a sec here. I'm having some technical difficulties. Where are my... Grab your keys from the motel room, okay? Well... It's time to be judged. Okay, it's Tab. Come on, guys. You asshole. Oh. <laughs> so I guess all these idiots were indoors. George McDonald is on out. Well, you'd think he grabbed his keys on the way out. But I must return to the room? Is that it? The guy around the corner really got me, man. That was... Ah. <laughs> okay. Can I crawl under this? There's the comment, that's cool. And jump over it. This is where I came from, right? Yeah. Grab your keys from the motel room, okay? Here we go. Asshole. Dang, let me in. Get in the van and escape. What have I become? Been on the road for what feels like a lifetime, but it's only been a few days. The first day was peaceful. A surreal, queasy kind of peaceful. But that all turned to shit fast. The Doomsday Cult are out here looking for sacrifices. On top of that, shards of the comet have started to hit the planet. I've been driving by smoking craters and hearing some strange wildlife out there. Call me crazy, but I swear it only started after the comet's meteor showers. What is that thing? Doggy dog world. You know, this
this has some very, um, like Duke Nukem vibes, I guess you could say. You know, he's very, like, kind of has, like, a grisly, like, really gruff voice. Um, you know, kind of like a macho sort of tough guy in a decaying world. But at the same time, you know, he's trying to get back to his family, Not so... These guys again. It is time to be... Jeez, man. I didn't quite understand what the what the gasoline was for. here it seems like hopefully I can find some health kill or get killed he did mention some strange wildlife right oh hey the road to nowhere I mean I know this isn't like I'm gonna have to shoot my way out tunnel and they had to stop because of funding so it's literally a road that just ends it's literally a road that ends it's always wanted to check it out love stuff like that I think it is somewhere in the Blue Ridge Mountain is it Bryson City? I don't know alright kill or get killed Well, I definitely have ammo. I need health. There we go. I don't exactly know how much health I have. That's why I was stressing about it. Hey, Japanese. lighting for that. It seems like the head is the weak spot and the body is transparent. The lighting for that is really cool. Oh god, okay.
Maybe there's a set time and maybe they'll just keep respawning unless I go for it, right? through the subway. If I can get inside Diamond Point Heights and make it to the top floor, I can get better reception. Hopefully you'll answer. Either way, I'll get to you guys, I promise. Just gotta catch that five-star view we've always wanted first. Get to Diamond Ridge Heights. the greatest you know first person shooters aren't really my thing but we'll have to make do because I'm always on the search for great horror I wonder if the axe works decent on those guys reminds me of the old days of gaming where like you couldn't really tell shit because of the pixels. I like the music too. The music is nice. Yeah, I can't see. Okay, I have to get past this somehow. Let's try going towards here.
of came at him, but it's all good. <laughs> Is this... came from. Well. Get to Diamond Ridge Heights. Okay. Okay, that's just, it loops back around, so I'm guessing we have to continue going this way. Maybe we have to find some way into this building. There's like this this fountain area and we maybe here? Enter the building. still out there. If you and the kids didn't make it, what's the point? Call That's me right. Ben. I forgot I'm even going to my oh, family. Wait, battery died. This sounds like a very 80s kind of... Well, I guess it didn't really specify the, the year. Maybe this is just letting us know that we're in for the long haul. This is some crazy shit. That's right. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. I like this. This is... This is cool. It's the sinking ship. It's the sinking ship. That's right. Scrapers fall, strange alien temples rise up, presumably to imprison the few survivors who knows what nefarious purposes. As quickly as we built civilization, it's been torn apart by these freaks far quicker. But I know I'm not giving up. I'll keep fighting to the end of days. That was interesting. I like that. I like that quite a bit, actually. It explored some interesting ideas. Um... 
It'd be cool to see this as a full feature game. Like, does humanity survive? You know, we already have enough problems as it is, and then we gotta deal with crazy cultists. Yeah, I mean, what happened to the prisoners? What happened to the posters I was collecting? It was cool, it was like Duke Nukem vibes from back in the day, you know, it was fun. Normally, uh, first person shooters aren't my thing, but I, I enjoyed that, I enjoyed that. I felt like a badass with the shoddy at the end, especially, so that was, that was kind of cool. I don't get to, I don't get to play too many uh, first person shooters, so I, I really enjoyed that. That was good, that was good. That third level though, like the lighting, it was, it was really dark, that's my only thing, I got, I got a little bit lost. But I enjoyed that, it was a fun action romp. Alright. Alright, well I guess that was it, right? So we should have... A, um, we completed it. Let's see what the guy says. Maybe nothing? Maybe we just gotta find the next key. Alright.